In a bold move that has sent ripples through the global defense community, Russia has unveiled five new military aircraft that seemingly defy the very laws of physics. These groundbreaking aircraft, presented at a high-profile defense expo, showcase a stunning leap in aviation technology, reflecting the Kremlin's commitment to maintaining and expanding its military prowess. Combining futuristic designs with advanced aerodynamics, cutting-edge propulsion systems, and unparalleled maneuverability, these aircraft promise to redefine aerial warfare as we know it. As the world looks on with a mix of awe, skepticism, and concern, the potential impact of these developments is vast, both for the balance of military power and the future of aviation technology. Before we start, hit the like and subscribe buttons for more updates. One of the most striking revelations is the Falcon X-7, a hypersonic fighter jet that appears to push the boundaries of speed and maneuverability to new limits. Unlike traditional aircraft that struggle to maintain stability and control at high speeds, the Falcon X-7 is designed to operate comfortably above Mach 6, more than six times the speed of sound. What makes this aircraft truly extraordinary is its ability to combine extreme speed with agility, a combination rarely achieved in aviation. The Falcon X-7 employs a dual-mode propulsion system that integrates both scramjet and turbojet technologies. This system allows the aircraft to transition seamlessly between subsonic, supersonic, and hypersonic speeds, enabling it to outpace any current interceptor or surface-to-air missile. The use of lightweight, heat-resistant composite materials in its construction reduces weight while enhancing durability, allowing it to withstand the immense thermal stresses experienced during hypersonic flight. Furthermore, the Falcon X-7 is reported to feature an advanced avionics suite with AI-driven flight control systems, enhancing pilot decision-making and situational awareness. This technology allows the aircraft to perform complex maneuvers that would be impossible for a human pilot alone, effectively defying conventional aerodynamics. Another head-turner in Russia's new fleet is the Void Phantom, a stealth bomber that seems to defy the basic principles of gravity. At first glance, the aircraft's radical design with its sleek and elongated body appears more suited to science fiction than real-world aviation. The Void Phantom utilizes a revolutionary anti-gravity propulsion system, the details of which remain highly classified. Experts speculate that it leverages a form of electromagnetic propulsion, generating lift and thrust without reliance on conventional jet engines. The bomber's stealth capabilities are unparalleled, featuring a composite material that absorbs radar waves and reduces heat signatures to near-invisible levels. Additionally, the Void Phantom incorporates a unique cloaking mechanism that bends light around the aircraft, rendering it virtually undetectable to the naked eye and most optical tracking systems. This combination of anti-gravity propulsion and advanced stealth technology would allow the Void Phantom to conduct missions deep into enemy territory without being detected, providing a significant strategic advantage. Its payload capacity remains classified, but rumors suggest it can carry a range of conventional and nuclear warheads, adding another layer of deterrence to Russia's military arsenal. Russia's third entry into this futuristic fleet is the Sky Shark, a next-generation unmanned combat aerial vehicle, UCAV, that utilizes quantum computing to operate autonomously in complex combat environments. Unlike traditional drones that rely on pre-programmed routes or human-controlled flight paths, the Sky Shark is driven by a quantum AI system capable of processing vast amounts of data in real time. This advanced AI not only makes strategic decisions on the fly, but also adapts to rapidly changing battlefield conditions with unprecedented speed and accuracy. The Sky Shark's sleek, angular design enhances its aerodynamic efficiency and minimizes radar cross-section, making it an exceptionally stealthy platform. It can be equipped with a variety of payloads, ranging from precision-guided munitions to electronic warfare systems. The quantum AI enables the drone to carry out coordinated swarm attacks with other drones or aircraft, saturating enemy defenses and overwhelming their response capabilities. Furthermore, its machine learning algorithms allow it to learn from each engagement, continually refining its tactics and decision-making processes. Adding to its versatility, the Sky Shark has a hybrid propulsion system that allows it to switch between jet and electric power. This feature not only extends its operational range, but also reduces its acoustic signature, making it even harder to detect. The implications of this technology are profound, 
suggesting a future where autonomous drones could dominate the skies, executing missions with a level of efficiency and effectiveness far beyond human capabilities. Next on the list is the Thunderstrike, a versatile VTOL aircraft designed to provide rapid deployment and support for both offensive and defensive operations. Unlike traditional VTOL jets, which often compromise on speed and maneuverability due to their complex propulsion systems, the Thunderstrike features an innovative thrust vectoring mechanism that allows it to perform vertical takeoffs and landings without sacrificing performance. This design is particularly advantageous for operations in urban environments or remote areas where conventional runways are unavailable. The Thunderstrike's propulsion system is based on a plasma augmented jet engine, which generates thrust by superheating air molecules to create plasma, significantly increasing thrust efficiency and reducing fuel consumption. This system allows the aircraft to reach supersonic speeds within seconds a capability unheard of in current VTOL designs. Moreover, the Thunderstrike is equipped with a suite of advanced sensors and electronic warfare capabilities, enabling it to serve multiple roles, from air superiority and close air support to reconnaissance and electronic warfare. One of the most remarkable aspects of the Thunderstrike is its adaptive wing technology, which changes shape in response to flight conditions, optimizing lift, drag, and stability. This morphing wing capability provides unparalleled maneuverability, allowing it to perform high G turns and evasive maneuvers that would normally result in catastrophic structural failure for conventional aircraft. By incorporating this adaptive technology, the Thunderstrike demonstrates how new materials science and smart engineering can come together to produce an aircraft that appears to bend the laws of aerodynamics. Completing Russia's lineup of revolutionary aircraft is the Valkyrie, a supersonic helicopter that challenges conventional wisdom about rotorcraft limitations. Traditionally, helicopters are limited by aerodynamic constraints that prevent them from achieving high speeds. But the Valkyrie breaks this barrier with its unique coaxial rotor design combined with an auxiliary jet propulsion system. This configuration allows the Valkyrie to reach speeds in excess of 400 miles per hour far surpassing any existing helicopter model. The Valkyrie's aerodynamic design reduces drag and maximizes lift, allowing it to operate effectively at high altitudes and in extreme weather conditions. This makes it ideal for special operations, search and rescue, and rapid deployment missions where speed and flexibility are paramount. The helicopter is also equipped with an array of advanced weaponry and countermeasures, including laser-guided missiles, electronic jamming pods, and anti-missile flares, making it a formidable platform for both offensive strikes and defensive operations. What sets the Valkyrie apart is its adaptive rotor technology, which can alter the pitch and angle of the rotor blades in response to airspeed and altitude changes. This adaptability allows the aircraft to maintain stability and control at supersonic speeds, an achievement that was previously thought to be impossible for a helicopter. Furthermore, the aircraft's advanced avionics systems are integrated with augmented reality interfaces, providing pilots with real-time data overlays and enhanced situational awareness. This not only improves pilot reaction times, but also significantly reduces the cognitive load during high-stress combat situations. The unveiling of these five aircraft has profound implications for global military dynamics. Firstly, the technological advancements represented by these designs suggest that Russia is not only catching up to Western military aviation capabilities, but potentially surpassing them in certain areas. The ability to achieve hypersonic speeds, anti-gravity propulsion, quantum AI-driven autonomy, and supersonic rotary wing flight places Russia at the forefront of a new era in military aviation. Secondly, the potential deployment of these aircraft could significantly alter the balance of power in several geopolitical hotspots, particularly in Eastern Europe, the Arctic, and the Asia-Pacific region. With the ability to rapidly deploy advanced aircraft that can penetrate enemy defenses with impunity, Russia could leverage these assets to exert influence, deter adversaries, and secure strategic advantages in contested regions. However, the introduction of these new technologies also raises critical questions about the future of warfare and the risks associated with them. The potential for AI-driven drones to operate autonomously in combat scenarios, for instance, could lead to ethical dilemmas and unintended escalations. Similarly, 
The use of anti-gravity propulsion and other advanced technologies might provoke an arms race, prompting other nations to accelerate their own military research and development efforts. While the unveiling of these aircraft has certainly captured the world's attention, there is also a healthy degree of skepticism regarding their feasibility. Many experts question whether the technologies described, such as anti-gravity propulsion and quantum AI, are truly operational or merely theoretical concepts showcased for strategic purposes. The development of these aircraft would require breakthroughs in multiple fields, including materials science, quantum computing, electromagnetics and aerodynamics, areas where progress has been steady but not revolutionary. Moreover, the logistical and financial challenges associated with mass-producing such advanced aircraft are significant. Even if these technologies are viable, scaling them up for deployment across an entire air force would require vast resources, infrastructure, and expertise. As such, some analysts suggest that these aircraft might be part of a broader psychological warfare strategy aimed at projecting power and deterring potential adversaries. Regardless of the current feasibility of these aircraft, their introduction marks a pivotal moment in the evolution of military aviation. The concepts and technologies on display reflect a shift toward multi-domain operations, where air, space, and cyber domains are increasingly interlinked, and traditional boundaries between these realms are becoming blurred. The integration of quantum computing, anti-gravity propulsion, and adaptive materials technology represents a new era where air superiority is not just about speed or stealth, but about flexibility, integration, and multi-dimensional capabilities. The Falcon X-7, Void Phantom, Skyshark, Thunderstrike, and Valkyrie each embody different aspects of this strategic evolution. The Falcon X-7, with its hypersonic speeds, presents a platform that can disrupt traditional aerial and missile defense systems, effectively rendering current radar and missile systems obsolete. Meanwhile, the Void Phantom challenges not just traditional aircraft detection methods, but also foundational understandings of how objects move and interact in the sky. On the other hand, the Skyshark's AI-driven autonomy highlights the shift toward unmanned systems that can operate independently in swarms, collaborate seamlessly with human-piloted aircraft, or conduct precision strikes with minimal human oversight. The implications of these developments go beyond the battlefield. They signal a future where military hardware is increasingly defined by its software and artificial intelligence capabilities, making it more like a supercomputer that flies rather than a conventional aircraft. As nations race to achieve parity or superiority in these emerging technologies, the risk of conflict escalation rises, particularly in contested regions like the South China Sea, Eastern Europe, or the Middle East. The deployment of such advanced aircraft could lead to a new form of aerial deterrence, where nations might hesitate to provoke conflict due to the unpredictable and potentially devastating capabilities of these platforms. The unveiling of these aircraft has already set off a wave of concern among global powers, potentially sparking a new arms race. The United States, China and NATO allies are likely to accelerate their own research and development programs in response, focusing on advanced avionics, hypersonic propulsion, artificial intelligence and electromagnetic technologies. The fear is that as more nations develop similar capabilities, the threshold for conflict could lower as each side may feel pressured to act preemptively to avoid being technologically outmatched. This scenario could also lead to an increase in cyber warfare and electronic warfare tactics, as adversaries attempt to sabotage or neutralize each other's advanced military systems without resorting to kinetic actions. The reliance on AI and complex avionic systems also opens up new vulnerabilities. An advanced drone like the Skyshark, for instance, could be hacked or jammed, turning a technological marvel into a potential liability. Furthermore, the development and deployment of these advanced aircraft could shift the dynamics of regional alliances and partnerships. Nations with limited defense budgets may seek to develop asymmetric capabilities that can counter or at least complicate the use of such advanced aircraft. For example, countries may invest in electronic warfare systems, cyber capabilities, or advanced surface-to-air missiles designed specifically to counteract the unique properties of these new Russian aircraft. Alternatively, smaller nations might turn to new partnerships or enhance existing ones with major powers to deter Russian aggression or influence, leading to a realignment of global military alliances. 
The creation of these revolutionary aircraft will not only reshape military strategy, but also have profound impacts on the industrial and technological sectors within Russia and beyond. Developing such high-tech military systems requires cutting-edge advancements in fields like materials, science, artificial intelligence, quantum computing, and aerospace engineering. For Russia, this represents an opportunity to push its scientific and industrial base forward, potentially fostering innovations that could spill over into civilian sectors. The materials used in these aircraft, for instance, such as heat-resistant composites for hypersonic flight or radar-absorbing surfaces for stealth capabilities, could find applications in civilian aviation, space exploration, and even automotive industries. Similarly, the advancements in quantum computing and artificial intelligence driven by military needs could accelerate Russia's position in these critical technological fields, leading to developments in communications, data analysis, and automation that could have broad economic benefits. On the flip side, the high costs associated with developing, testing, and deploying such advanced systems may strain Russia's defense budget. Military expenditures could divert resources away from other pressing needs, such as economic development, healthcare, or infrastructure. Moreover, the race to develop these technologies could prompt international sanctions or economic measures, as Western nations seek to limit Russia's access to the materials, components, and technologies necessary for further advancements. The geopolitical implications of these new aircraft could therefore extend beyond the military realm, influencing economic policies, trade relationships, and technological partnerships globally. While these aircraft have been described as defying physics, it's crucial to understand that they are, in fact, pushing the limits of our current understanding and capabilities within the bounds of physical laws. To fully appreciate this, we need to delve into some of the technical aspects that make these aircraft so revolutionary. For aircraft like the Falcon X-7, operating at hypersonic speeds, above Mach 5, introduces a host of engineering challenges that must be overcome. One of the most significant issues is thermal management. At such high speeds, the friction between the aircraft's surface and the atmosphere generates immense heat, which can exceed 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit. Traditional materials would melt or weaken under these conditions which is why the Falcon X-7 likely incorporates advanced ceramic composites or carbon-carbon materials that can withstand these temperatures while maintaining structural integrity. The aerodynamic design must also account for shock waves and pressure changes that occur at hypersonic speeds. Conventional control surfaces like ailerons and rudders become ineffective, so the Falcon X-7 probably uses innovative techniques like plasma actuators or air-breathing engines to maintain stability and control. These technological leaps allow for maneuverability that was previously thought impossible at such speeds, giving the aircraft an edge in both offense and defense. The Void Phantom's claimed anti-gravity propulsion has raised more eyebrows than any other feature of the newly unveiled aircraft. While details remain classified, the concept suggests the use of electromagnetic fields to counteract gravitational forces. In theory, manipulating gravitational forces could provide lift without the need for conventional wings or rotors. While no publicly known technology can achieve this on a practical scale, speculative theories in physics, such as those involving quantum field interactions or negative energy states, have been discussed in scientific circles. If the Void Phantom indeed uses a form of electromagnetic propulsion, it would require breakthroughs in energy generation and manipulation far beyond what is currently possible. Harnessing enough energy to produce a counter-gravitational effect would need compact reactors or power sources capable of immense outputs, which again brings us into the realm of speculative science. The quantum AI driving the Sky Shark represents another leap forward merging advanced computing with military aviation. Quantum computers operate on qubits, which can represent and process more data than traditional binary computers. This allows quantum AI to perform complex calculations and pattern recognition tasks exponentially faster than classical AI systems. For military applications, this could mean real-time processing of vast sensor data to predict enemy movements, assess threats, and make split-second decisions that outpace human capabilities. This type of AI could also learn from experience much more efficiently. Unlike conventional AI, which requires thousands of simulated iterations to learn a behavior, 
quantum AI could generalize from far fewer examples, making it adaptable and responsive to new situations. In a dogfight scenario, for instance, the Sky Shark could predict an opponent's maneuver based on minimal input, turning the tide of battle almost instantaneously. For aircraft like the Thunderstrike, the concept of morphing wings is another area where new physics and engineering principles are being applied. By using materials that change shape in response to electrical inputs, electroactive polymers, or even temperature changes, shape memory alloys, the Thunderstrike's wings can adapt in real time to optimize flight performance. This allows the aircraft to switch from efficient cruising configurations to high agility combat setups in an instant, providing versatility that fixed wing aircraft cannot match. The ability to perform VTO, vertical takeoff and landing operations, while retaining supersonic capabilities, also involves revolutionary engineering. Plasma-based jet engines, which ionize air to create thrust, are not only fuel efficient, but also produce less noise and heat, reducing the aircraft's detectability. This kind of propulsion, combined with morphing wings, means that the Thunderstrike can operate in environments where traditional aircraft would struggle, including urban areas, dense forests, and mountainous terrain. If you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel. Also, could you leave your comments below and tell us, what's your take on Russia's new military aircrafts? We want to hear from you. Thank you for watching and see you next time.